Hey everybody, so first thing I want to say, I apologize for the super late video. Um, this video is going to be actually one month ago compared to what's actually happening now. So it might be a little bit confusing for some people if you've been catching up with me, you know, in real time. But I, like I said, I apologize. I've been super busy. I finally got down to editing everything. I got so much content to go through. But I just want to make this, you know, right away so you guys know what's going on. So what you guys are seeing is one month ago content. And then I'm going to try my best to get everything, like, caught up. So anyways, I just want to say that. Really hope you enjoy the video. Hey, everybody. So we're back from the Iowa trip. And now it's time to go back to drifting. And as you guys know, I've been posting on my TikTok that August 14th, we're going to lead to Navarre for Speedway, baby! Let's go! Before I go to Rock for Speedway and, you know, completely mess everything up. So this coming Sunday, which is in the video this Sunday, right? The weekend before Rock for Speedway, I'm going to get some practice in. The reason why is because I've noticed that I'm trying to... Okay, so we fixed the counter steering from last year, right? We don't have to worry about that. The drift car, despite after the crash, we got it salvaged. So what I'm looking for right now is I'm, I'm going to hope... Maybe I could give a little bit more, you know, caster in the front, mostly on the driver's side to see if I can get a little bit more reaction, which is why I want to test all this thing out this coming Sunday's drift event. Another thing too, um, man, the FDM, I got a good look at it and wow, I didn't realize how beat she is. She is tired. So what I'm going to do in this episode is freshen up. As you guys know, there are, you know, she's missing her rear tires because I finally found some decent sets. I think we got about two two sets of two. I got it for free, so I'm really excited, which is the kicker for it. A pair of good tires, and I also got a pair of burners, you know, where they're like, you know, the tread's not, you know, the best, but hey, I got it for free, I can't complain, you know? If it's free, it's good enough for me. I got lazy when I first put those 16s on the car, because I had four of them, and I only painted one of them. So we're gonna finally match all of them now because obviously I'm going for the white look. The wing got damaged when we're coming back from Iowa, right? So hopefully I can get that fixed. We see mess with the front suspension and tight everything down. Oh my God, I forgot to buy log type. I was literally at the store too. As drift cars are known for, things loosen up and then stuff just boom. You know. I can already hear the comments. Cho, why are you painting the wheels on the trailer? It doesn't matter. We're going to be flipping these boards anyways. Besides, I got nowhere else to spray for the overspray. So better on my stuff than somebody else's. I'm supposed to use the you know playing cards, but I thought paint painter's tape would just work just fine. now I think what I'm just gonna do is I'm probably just gonna like duct tape it or something the tint they used it was holding it pretty good until obviously you know so I'm probably just gonna use some clear tape or something just to keep it together right if it becomes too dangerous I'll just take it off completely so it doesn't hurt anybody but for now I think some tape it might look a little ratchet but it'll hold so the next thing we're gonna be doing is fixing um, the lights so I, uh, if you look right back here, so I hit the wall a while back at GLD, and when I did that, uh, these guys kind of, you know, snapped and broke. So, I actually got some spares, which is kind of ironic because I actually don't have my brake lights wired up, so I don't know why I'm fixing this. Look at this, bro. The impact completely pinched this right here. So I think what I could do is if I could just like probably hammer this out this way, it should push it out this way. It should. So let's give that a try. Time to bring out the hammer. <laughs> It looks 
great right here. And you look over this way. Oh, oh no. Anyone got Bondo? It's flush-ish, you know, it's flush-ish. All right, let's put it on. Oh man, don't you just hate when that happens? Oh. Not bad, look. It's practically brand new. Uh. Uh. Mm. Honestly, I was just mostly worried about those solid bushings because I swear I felt like I had a rattle. I remember at one time, a long time ago, one of them was loose. So I'm just double checking, make sure we don't have to repeat that lesson. That would be terrible if that thing just falls out. But everything else looks like it's in great shape. I don't think I see anything that needs to be uh, attention to detail. Everything looks like it where it needs to be. All right, so now let's go to the front end. So what I'm gonna do is adjust the caster. I'm gonna give this thing a little bit, just so. Yeah, maybe I should not do that. I have my impact gun with me. Maybe I should use my impact. No, my poor Milwaukee impact. You're so old, bro. I think I've been using this since like 2016. She's seen better days. No. Bro, they're already maxed out. There's nothing you can do now. Unless you cut it and make it shorter, but I think I, now it's starting to come back to me now why I didn't do that. Right here, there's a nut, right? That helps the adjustment. I remember I took that off so I could have more, like, I could push the thing forward. I remember when I did that, the car completely was undrivable because the car would lock up, like, like it's just undrivable at all. Like, we're having mega resistance. Maxing it out by the nut is probably our best, our best chance. So I guess it is what it is, right? It is what it is. I mean, it still drifts. It drifts just fine. I kind of wish it was a little bit more, like a little bit more responsive, but that that's like, that requires more technical details right there. And I, 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 I ain't trying to do all that technical detail stuff, so. So here's my plan right now. So it's getting a little dark now. I did everything I need to do, right? And I'm gonna clean up, make sure the wheels are taken care of. Once the wheels dry up and everything, I am going to, Put everything back together and then on sunday morning i'm gonna come over here um get her loaded and then be on my way to glt hey everybody today's tuesday not sunday because sunday got rained out so i'm here on tuesday and i thought i was gonna be by myself but then i found out everyone else is here so we're gonna try to get this thing you know practiced and then uh wish me luck let's go
good run. This is it. We're losing daylight. I got no headlight. You know, car's getting hot. Come on. I'm a little tired, big girl lie. This is it, I can feel it. Take it slow. Take it easy, no rushing. You're not Chris Forbes, Chris Forsberg. You're the best for recording. Hey, bro, we got you, we got you. Appreciate it. Here we go! Army! Oh,